An oath on La Femme Nikita. I've just finished a note on Hana. Uh, now I'm moving on to another uh, action movie, thriller, with a um, crime story, with a woman hero, La Femme Nikita. Um, to continue on the same line of thought, uh, women as protagonists in these uh, types of stories, It's it's definitely a, a domain to explore uh, in terms of eliminating sexism, the idea that women cannot beat you up, or cannot do too much in terms of effort or running or whatever. But at the same time, I hope I'm not being conservative or in any way sexist. I'm thinking that... Mm, Maybe it's not not the right way to go about it. Uh, first of all, I'm thinking William Golding. I noted a few days ago on um, on Lord of the Flies, and I was thinking of his interview in which he explains his main themes. Uh, the idea of, of, of Lord of the Flies, the main idea, seems to be that. It is about what happens uh, when you have no rules. And when you have no rules, in the words of uh, Golding, you have nothing. And then a major question was, and an issue was, why there are no women? Talking of a woman, here, heroine in Nikita, who kills people and beats so many up. Uh, I lost count, and she's so good as a... As a well, not an evil character, it's also true she's made to do this. That's part of the story. I mean, it's, uh, made, it's made more complicated. It's not about making a woman look bad, uh, show that he, she can be a badass, saying these films. Um, and she can be, and she can be as evil as any man you think of. No, it's with a twist here, because um, uh, there's no other way for her not her choice she's not in the end evil she's just abused and powerful it's 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 an interesting recipe as I said it's uh, she's weak she's 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 um, taken advantage of by by men obviously but then there's a flip side, and there's a reversal of fortune, like in that uh, great film with Jeremy Irons. Only very different, of course, that's a different, completely different legal story. A courtroom drama, this is something else, action back. And so, La Femme Nikita shows how powerful she can be, and it may be ab about, in the end, a victory of the good over the evil. But returning a bit to my point on Golding, Golding said, about Lord of the Flies, there are no, no women there because he's been a. Uh, he, he doesn't know about it. He, he, he was a father of sons, he, he knew about men. It, but he mentioned the fact that sex would, would have to be present, would both be set up or something like that. He said. And in terms of women, women shouldn't be um, worried about this equality thing because they're much better than men. So I like that idea. It seems that this is the trend. Uh, the Economist had the idea of, of, of the failing man, the fact that the man will be in decline, so to say, in the future, in terms of the jobs available, the fact that there's so many with, with, with no studies, w women get more and more educated in universities and all that. And the men who used to do these types of things, mining, and which become obsolete, truck drivers with driverless cars. So the future belongs to the woman. And coming back to 
my initial protestation. That's why I like to see women superheroes, but not super villains. I, I don't think they're that bad. That was the point I was trying to make, make paraphrasing William Golding. Women are better than men, so they should be better superheroes, not better <coughs> super villains.